you see the before and the after focus solution is the technique which i used to face knuckles in photoshop let me show you how to do that right now we are going to be using this image for reference so i'm just going to run my focus separation right now so i just go to my touch academy click on focus separation via gaussian blur and i'm going to be using a smaller radius to fix the knuckle so i'm going to use the radius of about 4.4 and i just click on ok now you can use any focus separation you have just make sure the gaussian blur radius is a small gaussian blur radius and after that i'm just going to pick my mixer brush tool so i come to my toolbar pick my mixer brush tool since we successfully separated our texture and our colors and the knuckles for this image are colors, I'll just pick my mixer brush tool. I'll just call to my corrective tone because I want to work only on the colors of this image. So I'll hide my high frequency texture and I'm just going to see only the colors. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm just going to brush those bright parts into this dark part of the knuckles like this. So I'm just going to increase the brush. I'll just brush from this bright side into the dark side because I'm mixing the colors right there. It's not going to affect the textures. That's why I first of all separate the colors and the texture so that I can work on the colors separately and also work on the texture separately if I need to. But right now, I'm just going to work only on the colors because we're trying to fix those dark colors right there on the knuckles. So I'm just going to brush in those bright parts into these dark knuckles like this. So let's quickly see the before and after of what we just did. If I turn on my high frequency texture back on, you can see the before you can see how dark the knuckles are looking and um this is the after you can see how bright are looking right now before and after so i'm just going to continue doing this for the whole of this image and i'm still going to show you how you can even fix it more so you don't really have to worry about the texture just work on the colors and just mix the colors just make sure you are pushing those bright parts into the dark parts of this image so if you have other methods that you use to fix your knuckles, let me know in the comment section. But I prefer using this focus pressure method and it has been working for me. Now let's see our before and after. These are before. You can see how dark it is and these are after. You can see they are looking brighter. And there's another thing you can do to fix it even more and I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So just come to your adjustment layer click on curves adjustment layer and just increase the brightness of the curves like this and after that just invert the layer by pressing on ctrl i or command i for using the mark to invert the layer and just pick your normal brush tool this time once you pick your normal brush tool make sure opacity is set to 100 flow is set to 100 make sure you're using a white brush so just click on this icon right here to change your brush to white and just paint on the knuckles like that to make it brighter like that so this is another way you can make your knuckles bright or rather fix your knuckles like that and after that i'm just going to count my mask and just feather it to make it blend like that let's say 8 pixels 8.5 pixels is okay and then choose to reduce the opacity if you want to so i'm just going to reduce the opacity a little bit now you can see let me just group it and show you the before and after this is the before and this is the after the before and the after now i'm just going to give you a quick tip if you are working on an image that requires special attention to the knuckles i advise to create a special and a separate focus separation just for the knuckles let me show you what i mean by that for example look at this image right here i've done the focus separation for this image so this is the before and this is the after but if you look at the knuckles you can see the knuckles are still dark so what i'm going to do right now this is not an this is not an extreme case but if you have an extreme case that you have to work on the uh, knuckle separately after doing your focus separation just create another focus separation action just for the knuckle so i'll create another focus separation right now i'll click on my focus separation via gaussian blur and i'll just reduce the radius to about four and click on ok now i'll pick my mixer brush tool and i'm just going to hide my high texture and just brush on the knuckles separately like i said earlier because we've already worked on the skin so i'm just going to push on the knuckles separately like this just to fix only the knuckles and i'm just brushing the bright parts or the dark parts like that and remember it's not affecting the texture it's affecting only the colors so the texture will still be there but let's see the before and after you can see the before and the after so if you have an extreme situation that requires special attention to the knuckles, that's how you can fix it. If you find this video helpful, make sure to give it a like, 
so i hope you can see this video and learn from this video as well if you want to learn how to use the mixer brush make sure to click on this video showing right here yeah i'll see you guys in my next video stay creative